This is Sonic, and you're watching JD Frank 20. Is that badass or what? Man, Paramount is just hitting on all cylinders. And not only that, but a couple of days ago, Par uh, Paramount's even going to have, uh, is even rebranding their one of their networks and I'm calling it Paramount Plus, which is uh, slated to uh, debut in uh, March, which is dope. They're adding more more content. Uh, they're merging it with CBS All Access, which is a very good streaming service uh, that they provide. And it's going to add even more bonus content. Again, Paramount is hitting on all cylinders since they rebranded it, since they rebranded, uh, well, certain things. But that's neither here or there. Like right now, the fact that this this 11 second trailer they showed gets more hype than a full two minute trailer from any movie, it just shows you like, guys, you don't have to make two minute trailers out there, especially your first trailer to get the basic understanding because the problem is you're, sp you're giving out spoilers. You don't have to do two minute trailers you know, of certain things because you're going to give out results and then people are not going to be that suspenseful when the, the event does actually happen. Like, oh, this is going to happen at this part. Like, come on, stop doing these long trailers. But the fact that, you know, Paramount's doing everything brilliantly right now, I'm excited for the movie. It's going to be dope. You know, hopefully by April 8, 2022, you know, hopefully we, uh, it should be in theaters, but I highly doubt it. Like, let's be honest, movie theaters are becoming obsolete now. But either way, I'm excited. And I can't wait. Let me know what y'all think, and I'll see y'all later.